To get the images onto the main home page, we first need to go to the views.py file. It's in theta image views.py. We need to import the model that has the access to the database. So if we recall, models.py, we called the class theta image. So from views.py, we're going to access models.py. Models.py has the data, including the image, right? So we just need to import it. It's in the same directory, so dot models, import, and it's the name of the class, which is theta image. In home, we set up a variable, equal sign. Then we access the name of the class that we just imported. It's the one right here in line three. And then we take the objects. So this render, when we first did it for home.html, we only had two parameters. There was request, and then there was the name of the template. This is the second parameter. <clears throat> We're gonna add a third parameter for the, uh, for, for the data that we're getting from the database. We're gonna get all of it. So let's call it images. Doesn't have to be the same, but it's often convenient. We'll just change the format. Okay, so it was on one line. This could all be on one line. The, the, um, the line breaks don't matter in this case. So we're passing it three parameters. Parameter one is request, which is what we had before. Parameter two is the name of the template. If you recall, the template is in this directory called templates. And then we have theta images, home.html, which is right here. It's the bootstrap template. And then we now added a third parameter for all the it, all the data from the database. I'm going to start the server again, and I'm going to start the pipm shell. If you if you follow the tutorial and you you're still with on the same pipm shell, you don't have to do this. I'm just doing it again because pipm might be new for some people. So it's pipm shell. It'll activate the shell. Once the shell is activated, now I can use Django. So I've changed into the main project folder, which is called gallery. I'm gonna run the server again, just to test where we are. So it's localhost 8000. I'm gonna to go to the main page. So as you recall, the main page is a Django template and it has everything here. So we're gonna delete everything except for one of these blocks. So one of these blocks, I'm just trying to isolate. Uh, it's a div by row. In Visual Studio, Visual Studio Code, you can see, if you click on one of the divs, you can see 
where it matches. So I'm going to go, I just want one of these cards. So I'm going to delete the other 11. You should just have one card at this point. So you could check the terminal, make sure that there's no obvious errors. This, you can ignore this uh, CSS. This is a fairly minor one. Minor one. But you just want one card. 